As an Advocate System owner, you have chosen one of the best blood glucose and blood pressure monitoring systems on the market today. This training video, in conjunction with the owner's manual, contains important information about your system. While watching this training video, we suggest you use your owner's manual to follow along. Blood glucose and pressure monitoring plays an important role in diabetes control. Approximately 70% of diabetics also suffer from hypertension. The results you get with the Advocate Duo TD 3223 system can help you and your healthcare professional monitor and adjust your treatment plan to gain better control of your diabetes. Your meter comes with two 1.5 AAA size alkaline batteries. To install the batteries, make sure that the meter is turned off. Press the buckle on the battery cover and lift it up to remove the cover. Remove the old batteries and replace with two 1.5 AAA size alkaline batteries. If the batteries are inserted correctly, you will hear a beep. Close the battery cover. Your meter comes with time, date, unit of measurement, temperature and pressure, select speaking function, English or Spanish presets. However, if you need to change these items, or if you replace the batteries, you will need to reset the setting of the meter. To set any of these items, you must first enter the setting mode. The set button is the small button located on the right side of the unit below the data port. As you continue to go through the set procedures, we suggest that you use the index finger or thumb on one hand to press the memory button to adjust each set item and the thumb of the other hand to press the set button. Take a little time to determine the best method of holding the system while performing the set procedures. Step 1. Start with the meter off, then press the set button. The meter is now in the setting mode. You can start setting up the meter. Step 2 and 3. Set the year. The year will appear first with the year setting flashing. Press and release the M button to advance one year. To move faster, keep pressing the M button until the desired number appears. With the correct year on the display, press the set button and then the month segment flashes. Step two, set the month. Press and release the M button until the correct month appears. To move faster, hold the M button down. With the correct month on the display, press the set button and then the day segment flashes. Set the day. Press and release the M button until the correct day appears. To move faster, hold the M button down. With the correct day on the display, press the set button and then the hour segment flashes. Step four, set the hour. Press and release the M button to advance one hour. To move faster, hold the M button down. With the correct hour on the display, Press the set button and then the minute segment flashes. Set the minutes. Press and release the M button to advance one minute. To move faster, hold the M button down. With the correct minute on the display, press the set button and then the current unit of measurement starts flashing. Step six, select milligrams per deciliter mg slash dl or millimoles per liter mmol slash l. Milligrams per deciliter is standard in the United States. Millimoles per liter is the standard unit of measurement in Canada, Latin America, and parts of the Caribbean. Press and release the M button to select the unit of measurement you want to use. Press the set button and then the current unit of blood pressure flashes. Select the unit of blood pressure, either millimeters of mercury, mmHg, or kilopascals, kPa. Your meter can display test results in millimeters of mercury or kilopascals. Use the unit of blood pressure that you are most familiar with. Press and release the M button until the unit of blood pressure you are choosing appears on the display. Press the set button and the current unit of temperature will start flashing. Select C degrees for centigrade or F degrees for Fahrenheit. Press and release the M button to select the unit of temperature you want to use. Press the set button and the meter will display DEL with a flashing M symbol. Step 8. When DEL and blinking M symbol is displayed, if you do not want to delete the memory, 
press the set button again to skip this step. If you would like to delete all memory, press the M button. Both DEL and the M symbol will flash. Press the M button again to delete all memory. Clear all appears and then the monitor automatically goes to the next step and the speaking volume number flashes. Step 10. Select the speaking volume. The meter displays VOL, the volume symbol and a flashing number. Press the M button to select speaking volume from 0 to 7, where 0 is off and 7 is the loudest. Then press the set button to proceed to the next step. Select language. Press the M button to select. L1 is for English and L2 is for Spanish. The setting mode is all completed. Press the set button to turn off the meter. Off is displayed before shutdown. Congratulations, you have finished setting your meter.